Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to another video from Night Hunter Studios and today we are doing the second vlog for Grand Theft Auto Darklight and today's vlog is a little bit of a different vlog because we aren't really focusing on the subject of the film itself we're going to be talking about a new series that we're going to be running for Grand Theft Auto Darklight um, so let's go straight to the video so as you may be aware, a lot of you actually ask a lot of questions to do with the film in the comment section of some of our videos. I mean, with the first vlog and the announcement video, we had a couple of questions from you guys about what the platform is going to be um, filmed on, about certain characters that are going to be returning. Uh, you keep asking these questions in the comment section and it's brilliant. The only issue is, um, we confirm some of the information uh, and we reply to you, but a lot of people don't see it, so they miss out as well. So this is what's going to happen from now on. If you send in your questions in the comment section or emailing us, um, we will answer them in this new Q&A series we're going to be doing. What we're going to do is one video, we're going to be collecting all your questions together and answering them. And then you guys send in more questions and we answer them. That's how it's going to work. It's very simple. This means that you guys learn more information and we can release information more efficiently. So what we're going to do now is we're going to answer a couple of questions that you guys sent in. Now obviously we've answered these questions in the comment section, but we're still going to answer them in today's first Q&A video. So the first question was, what platform are you guys making this film on? Now to clear this up, we're going to be using the Xbox One. So all of the footage is going to be in 1080p. That means there is a high definition experience for you guys, and it's satisfaction from us knowing that the video and the film will be very very good quality. One other question that was sent in was, do you have any idea of the opening credit song for Darklight? Now, we do actually know what the opening credit song is going to be, and we know who's going to sing it, but we can't release any information about it yet, because of course, as you know, we like to keep things quite secretive until the film actually does release. The third question that we're going to be answering today is, a user sent in this question. Does the Spectre have something personal against the agency, or is it just a mission he is trying to accomplish for someone? Like everything else for us, it's very difficult for us to answer this question, because we can't really release any information about it at all. Because of course, we've written the script and the stories behind it, but it's up to you guys. You guys decide if he was a good guy or a bad guy. You guys decide, actually, what his intentions were. However, what we can say, you're going to have to wait until Dark Knight releases to find out if this question um, or find out the answer to this question, sorry, because it may actually be answered in Darklight, it may not be. If not though, we will sure cover it in a later Q&A video. The final question for today's Q&A video is, was Hessler, the man at the end of Insurgency, the Spectre? The answer to this question is, no, he wasn't. You're going to have to find out to see who Hessler actually is in Grand Theft Auto Darklight. He plays a key role, nothing that I can say up at the minute, but you'll find out soon. Anyway, that's been for today's video guys, we hope you've enjoyed the idea of the Q&A videos. Please send in your questions, we'll answer them in the later Q&A videos as we've said. And we hope you've enjoyed the answer to today's questions. Remember to follow us on Twitter for daily updates on Grand Theft Auto Darklight and to subscribe so you don't miss out on new content from us. Thank you very much for watching guys and we'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.